Happy Thursday. My name is Philosophical and I'm here at the Learning Garden in Venice, Venice, LA. This is the Venice High School Learning Garden. It's a very exciting place. I got a tour of this a few days ago and we came back and now we're just going to walk around and I'll share some of the exciting things happening here. I have also was just walking around barefoot, got stung by a friendly bee on my toe. So I'm feeling good and excited about gardens and permaculture because walking around barefoot is totally worth the risk of getting stung by a bee. So I'm really excited to be here now with all these baby plants. We got fig trees in here, all kinds of fruit trees, exciting things growing. They got aquaponics here. We're just going to stroll around and check out some of the excitement. Um, but this place here is really cool because kids in high school are getting to learn about composting and growing their own food and uh, just creating sustainability in many different ways um, so they've got like a full verma composting system which is where you use worms and uh, that's over on the other side they've got like a zillion pounds of, of uh, fresh soil that was dropped off here which smells really good um, there's a, a beautiful mural that some of the students made that says connected because indeed everything is interconnected on this beautiful planet earth so you can see that mural there um, and uh, yeah let's walk this way for a little bit I was given a little info about this place it's used as a community gathering space for not just students but people from the whole LA area and uh, transition LA of the transition town movement has their gatherings here um, in this communal space they've also got this really cool concept of, a, of a, seed, a seed swap where you come here and you can swap your organic seeds and uh, a lot of people are working on seed saving so that we can stop all this uh, genetically modified stuff and continue to grow organic food which is what organic is silly to call it organic it's just non-toxic it's what we've been doing for 99% of human history that's what organic food is and that's what they're growing here at the learning garden they've got some fresh veggies over here check out these swabs amazing this is what you can do with a tiny little garden and a little bit of love or a lot of love here let's walk out into the main they've got all kinds of raised beds here and it's really cool because this is just right in the middle the heart of the city of LA it's this tiny little corner block right next to the high school and they've just got all this abundance growing here it just shows the potential of of any city block um, to just have fruit trees blossoming they've got like a permaculture setup and uh, and it's just really incredible we can keep walking even if it's bright it may be hard to see me but I'm not that good looking so uh, we can check out here they've got all kinds of herbs and cacti growing here um, as I started I was in the greenhouse over there. This is the aquaponics system. I'm not exactly sure how this works, but they've got lettuce growing here, and there's a whole natural filtration system. And um, as you can see, all the different permacultures are being used, different plant relationships. There's got birds. There's multi-species getting in here, especially the bees, which like to sometimes sting our toes to make us feel more alive. Um, over here, we've just got all kinds of raised beds. When I was here the other day, they had um, students, students visiting here, helping with the raised beds. Um, not just students from the high school, but from other visiting areas, um, because that is how you learn about gardens. You get your hands dirty, and I don't think my hands are dirty enough. I should probably pull some weeds while I'm here. Um, and 
and uh, it's just a really exciting project here, the Learning Garden. I'll post some links to um, some more information about this place, but it's just one of many examples of all over the world of people transforming urban space into huge gardens. It's part of the transition town movement, it's connected with that. So there's much to be excited for. You can start a learning garden in your area. Life is good. Thanks for watching and have a happy Thursday. Peace.